Well, I was sitting here and uh, I started hearing some screaming outside. And so I went to the front door and this is what I saw. Everybody's out. Yes. Come on, guys, let's knock it down. Come on. We're fine. My car wasn't hot. Q. They're knocking it down. We're fine. Q, where are you? We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Okay. Don't think so. He's back there. The dog's back there. Holy crap. Oh my goodness. That could have been us. Q, just be super safe, okay? If we get through this, yeah. just be super safe with everything we do. This guy, I don't know. Yeah. This, this guy is bad. See, he's fucking mad. He can't get his truck out of here. Fucking his dogs back there. Daisy. Hurry up, guys. Get here. Right. He's losing his house next door. Daisy. We gotta watch out for the gas. Explosion. Come on, firefighters. We don't need the whole park to go. Right. This guy's gone. We don't have to deal with this guy anymore. I hate to say it, but he's been... The fucking dog's in there, dude. That's, I know, I know. I'm more worried about secondary fire. Hurry up! Go! 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 One of the most scariest moments of my adult life almost lost everything I would have to say a good reason to separate inventory from your living quarters I live way too close if the wind was blowing from the Santa Ana's I would be in trouble but that's why we're moving our inventory and separating my living quarters to the warehouse quicker than I was planning.